So one of my favorite things to cook is shrimp. It's so easy, it takes practically less than 10 minutes to cook it and it has a nice oceany flavor and you can pair it with whatever you want, pasta, rice, vegetables by itself, you name it, you can have it. So as you see, I have the uh, deveined and cleaned shrimp without shell. Yet again, I want to keep it simple because I don't want to cover the whole beautiful flavor of the shrimp itself. So we have just the salt and pepper, a little bit of cumin and the red paprika. So I'm going to pour a little bit of olive oil so it has a little bit of coating and the seasonings will stick to our uh, shrimp. Massage it just a little bit and then put all those seasonings that we have. And then nicely mix it and then put more seasoning. Mix all those seasonings and then layer the uh, shrimp on your baking pan. Try to put them not on top of each other so they are not steaming but they are actually cooking. And those kind of shrimps you can also prepare for the uh, cocktail shrimp if you want. You can even add them to a salad if you want to when they cool down and they work perfectly fine. So it's really a good dish that you can transport, travel with and the rest of the uh, seasonings and that oil just pour over the uh, shrimp. So. I have my broiler on the very bottom, so I will do a little bit of acrobatics to try to put those shrimps in, but it's so worth it. So I have the broiler on a high, and I'm going to put shrimp right underneath the plate. And it practically takes only 2-3 minutes to have it cooked. You know when they are cooked when um, you don't see the grayish color of them anymore, and they become white and a little bit pinkish on the sides. They'll be just perfect. So I think we are ready with our shrimp now. So I'm going to get down on my knees and take out the shrimp from the broiler. They are nice and pink and even a little bit charred on the edges. So I'm going to use all those juices that are on the pan and I'm going to add a little bit of something. It's a mixture of the lemon, orange, a little salt and pepper and the chopped greens like cilantro and onions. That will add a little bit of flavor and also color to a greens. So I'm going to just sprinkle it bits and pieces here and there. Not too much. You don't want to make the shrimp look all green. And then just mix it together so all the spices incorporate along with the shrimp. Maybe just a little more. And then I think we are ready to pack it in the container. And head to our location. nice and warm for a little bit and cover it with aluminium foil and another dish is ready Try it, husband. Tell me what you think. <laughs> oh, oh. That oh. oh, my goodness. I'm glad I married you. <laughs> <laughs>